As I'm sure you know, tonight is the launch of this extraordinary program of early films from Korea. Um, we're also marking the centenary of Korean cinema. So obviously, the very first Korean film was made in 1919. I should also say that what you're about to watch is the earliest surviving film from Korea. So although the cinema began in 1919, the earliest film is from 1934. And it's the only surviving um, silent film. I'm also in that position, like I'm sure most of you, of discovering these films for the first time. And I've only seen one of them to date, and that was Tuition, which I saw at a special training event at the end of last year. I can't urge you enough to go and see it. Um, if you can imagine, if you don't know Korean film of that period, and I don't expect many people here do, um, if you can imagine a Korean form of neorealism, neo when I was watching it, although the film was made in 1940, it reminded me so much of De Sica's The Bicycle Thieves, and um, Bicycle Thieves was made eight years after that, but it is the most extraordinarily emotional, potent film about poverty, and really, really recommended. Um, I would like to thank our collaborators um, and partners on this project. So many, many thanks to the Korean Cultural Centre UK and also to the Korean Film Archive because without them, we would not be able to share these films with our audiences. Um, I'm now really delighted to introduce one of our partners. So please we welcome Dr. Ju Jin Suk, who is the um, director of the Korean Film Archive. Please we welcome her. Thank you. And I'm very happy and privileged to, uh, to be here introducing Korea's oldest films. And I would like to express my gratitude to the BFI and all the parts concerned in this special event, especially BFI and Korean Cultural Center UK and the crew members of the uh, Crossroads of Youth performance. And I would like to thank BFI for exchange program screened in our theater last December. And it fascinated Korean audience a lot more than we expected. And I appreciate BFI for giving us such a wonderful cinematic experience. Some people thought that there would be no more possibility to discover new old films after we found some in China and Russia. But in 2007, we found Crossroad of Youth, directed by An Jong-ha in 1934. Korea's oldest theater is Dansongsa, and a family member of the theater's previous owner had this nitrate film in his storage. This film is silent film. Unfortunately, the first roll out of the total line rolls turned into a solid mass because the can lid was slightly opened for a long time. Nevertheless, the original narrative was collected and it is significant that Crossroad of Youth is the oldest silent feature film existing in the Korean film archive. If you have a nitrate film, please do not preserve it at home. <laughs> Just okay. And now it gives me great pleasure to welcome the director of tonight's performance. So please we welcome Kim tae Young. Thank you very much. Thank you. Hello. Hi. Um, I'm very happy to be here to have a chance to present this show. Um, in 2007, 2008 maybe, uh, I just got a phone call from my friend Mo Eun Young, the programmer in Korean Film Archive. And she just asked me, uh, have you... Uh, do you like asylum films? So, yes, yes, I, I like it. Have you ever seen Korean asylum films? No. At that time, we didn't have any Korean asylum film. So she said, we found it. Uh, where did you get it? And there's someone else's garage. So, uh, okay, so let's come and see and in archive. So I, I went there, and then I watched it for the first time in my whole life, because in film school, uh, we watched a lot of silent films. We learned the film from silent film from US and Europe, you know, uh, Germany and Russia, even Japan. But we never have a chance to see Korean silent film. And I watched this one, and I, I, I don't understand the story. 
and then it's not it's not edited completely. And then I don't even know who is who, who is the main character, why he got angry, why she is crying. I didn't know. Uh, so I, so, and then uh, the, the programmer just suggests me to show this film to public. So how can we present this film? Hmm. Maybe we can try to uh, present this film in 1930s way. 1930s way means uh, we need a byonsa, which means a narrator, and we need the music. So okay, we'll try. And then I watch this film uh, hundreds, hundreds times <laughs> to figure out the story. So and then I, 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 I just watched the, how they leap moving. So then I found the actress, and she say, "Opa." Opa, okay, that means brother. So okay, she's the she's a sister of a main character. So why she's crying? So I just figure out. But it's a long journey to find the story. It's more difficult than you know writing my own script. So I wish you all like this show. Thank you very much. <laughs>